Hello! If you are watching this video, then you've probably been searching for something to do with blind spots and how to tackle them. My name is Martin Hamilton, and um, I've been helping people improve their performance for the last 25 years in business and personal life. And so in this short video, I'm going to show you uh, a cool little trick to help you work out where your own blind spot is quite literally and physically where your blind spot is, uh, but also from a metaphorical point of view, how you a top tip on how you can tackle any blind spots that you might have. Um, if you stick around to the end of the video, then I also have a free gift for you uh, with more tips just like the one that I'm about to share with you now. <clears throat> so, I remember when I was uh, learning to drive a long, long time ago now, uh, I, was, I was told by my parents, watch out for the your blind spot. So when you're um, looking to pull out into the, the right-hand lane and you look in your wing mirror, and this is the days before uh, clever cameras and clever wing mirrors, um, you have to watch out that there isn't a, a vehicle in your blind spot, so in that part of the, car, the, the, the rear of the car where you can't actually see what's going on. Um, I then learned later in life that we actually have a physical blind spot at the back of the eye. And I'm going to show you now how you can identify and find your blind spot. And it's really simple. All you have to do, <clears throat> take a piece of paper, just like this one, a piece of blank, a blank paper is best. Uh, put two dots on, on the paper, about I don't know, seven or eight centimetres apart, it doesn't really matter. Um, the smaller the dot, the better, but you know, make it big enough so that it's a, a realistic experience. And then all you do is you take the piece of paper and you hold it, I don't know, maybe 30 centimetres or so from you, from your face, um, and then cover your right eye so that you can only see out of your left eye, uh, and look at the dot on the right. So I'm covering my right eye and I'm looking at the dot on the right. So as I look at the dot on the right, if I move the paper either closer or further away, at one point, the dot on the left will disappear completely. And it does this quite simply because, well, I say simply, it's quite complicated, I think, in the back of the eye, but the, the back of the eye has rods and cones that are the receptors for, for light. Um, and right at the very back of the eye in the middle where the optic nerve takes the information to the brain, there are no receptors. So the brain, well, technically speaking, what, what, what should happen is that you should see two black dots everywhere you look. But the brain is very clever and it knows that there aren't two black dots in your field of vision and that would be annoying if you were to experience that. So what the brain does is it quite cleverly fills in the gap and it fills in with whatever is around that dot um, and it f fills it in with that colour which is why that dot then uh, effectively appears to disappear. So that's your physical blind spot that, that everybody has. Um, and that's quite a cool little uh, trick. And if you're um, running a, a team meeting or a session on um, <clears throat> on team performance, then you can use that as a way of illustrating that everybody has uh, at least one blind spot. Um, so, of course, the point of the, uh, the top tip that I'm going to share with you is what to do about the other blind spots that you might have, the more metaphorical blind spots. Uh, so if you are um, in a business situation or you are... Um, uh, in, even in a sporting uh, situation or in an artistic uh, environment and you're looking for your blind spots, the top tip is ask for feedback. Feedback is the way that you can identify where your blind spots might be because of course blind spots are things that potentially other people can see but you can't and the only way that you're going to then know about them is if people point them out to you. So that's my top tip um, on blind spots. <clears throat> I say, if you like that tip, then uh, somewhere in the description below this uh, video, you'll find a link to um, our guide that has um, another nine, I think about 10 and 10 or so in total, uh, tips just like that one uh, to help you improve your performance. So you can find it in the description below and you can also find it on the Smart Wisdom website. So. If you find that uh, little uh, video helpful, then it would do me a great service if you could give it a thumbs up and like it. Uh, better still, if you can share it with friends and colleagues um, who you think might benefit from looking into their own blind spots. Um, and uh, finally, if you would like further videos like this one, then don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell icon, which means that you get a notification every time there's a video like this with some, some top tips. And we plan to have lots more like this. So thanks very much for listening. Uh, enjoy the rest of your day and watch out for your blind spots. Thanks. Bye bye now.